love you and I know that you love me and if you want more vlogs you guys make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you comment down below alright you know the vibes it's Jay hand me the lighter I'm about to get litter than a bitch big, big period are you serious these hoes are acting all delirious and I ain't you know the vibes What's going on, J Squad? Plum it's Squad, it's your girl J. You already know. Welcome back to J Bow with a whole lot of great vibes going on, big period. Yeah. Okay, now today, what is today? Today is Thursday, uh, May the. No, today is not Thursday. Today is Friday, May the. It's May the 14th, you guys, and today is a motherfucking vlog. So before we get into this vlog, please make sure you are subscribed to my channels. Like this video, comment down below. Make sure you share your content. I was gonna make this vlog earlier, like start this vlog earlier, but I was rushing. I was late. I just came from my kitty cat, which was my bang bang wax appointment. Where I have to go, it's an hour behind where I was at and not an hour forward. So when I got here, I was an hour early. But thank God to the opening because I went in there to get open, if that makes any freaking sense. This camera is about to die, but no worries. I'm about to run into CVS real quick. So I am going to change this battery and we're going to get this vlog on and going. What do I have planned for today? You're gonna have to see. And I'm back. I just want to do like a little quick mini story time. Maybe it's not even a story time. I don't know. You know, everybody's having a situation with gas and shit like that, right? So on my way to where I was going, I was like, you know, I'm not going to wait to the last minute like I usually do to get gas. I was going to get gas when I had like 50 miles left. Y'all, I went to one gas station. No gas, only diesel. Went to the one across the street. No gas, only diesel. Went to the one three minutes down the street. No gas at all. I said, oh shit. I said, you know what? I ain't gonna panic. I'm gonna just pray about it. And I just know that the Lord is gonna provide where he needs to provide, when he needs to provide. Make a long story short. I be carrying around a lot of shit. I have to get my wallet, get my two phones, get my keys. Where's my car mask? In my wallet. I have to get a mask. I need new mask because I don't want to wear that mask. Hold on while I put my mask on. No one's gonna know. Let me just talk to you like this. You know how Biden made a tweet? I don't know what tweet he made. That tweet. But no one's gonna know. How are they gonna know if you've been vaccinated or not to tell you that you can or cannot wear your mask? Okay, so back to my story about the gas. So yeah, I was like, you know what? Let me just get back on the highway and hopefully the next... It's so pretty outside. Hopefully the next exit will have gas. Yes, they had gas. So that was just like the little story time that I wanted to give. Basically, the point that I'm trying to make is don't wait till the last minute to get you no gas because if you do, you might just run the fuck out. Literally, I was uh, going to the gas station and it was a line, y'all, like a long ass Starbucks, Chick-fil-A early in the morning type of line, okay? And basically, I'm like, what's going on? And why this car not moving? And why everybody just sitting behind this car and people getting in front of us? So I got the fuck out. I got out the car and I went to go tap on that woman's window. And I said, ma'am, are you gonna go? She said, oh, I ran out of gas. She said, my husband on the way, he's on his way to come help me. And I was like, okay. I said, well, do you think that you wanna put on your flashers? Like, to let people know to go around you? She must got her vaccine, honey, cause she ain't got no mask on. I ain't about to be wearing my shit neither, cause how the f Ain't nobody gonna tell me that I'm not vaccinated. They don't know if a bitch been vaccinated or not. Anywho, they be having CVS inside of Target? I've never seen a CVS inside of Target. So, uh, yeah, I was like, yeah, put your flashes on so people can go around you. She was like, oh yeah, yeah. I said, yeah. So then, she put her flashes on. Cars are still sitting behind her so I got out the car again I went to the car behind her cuz I'm in this line that's the only reason why I give a fuck cuz I'm in this line I said uh, sir I said can you go around her cuz she don't have no gas he said oh I didn't know that I said yeah you gotta go around her. I get in my car I gotta get back out the car cuz he he stuck he, he just I don't know why people drive foreign cars if you can't drive like you foreign if that make any sense I am looking for something and I don't know where it's at let me find an associate. Hi. 
Hi. Hi. I need your help if you can help. Hello? Um, we're not CVS, we're Target. CVS? Yes. Only the pharmacy Only part? The pharmacy okay, part. thank you. Mm -hmm. I don't have no special plans for this vlog, you guys. <sighs> this fucking mess. I'm gonna talk to you when I get outside, cause shit. I like to see my lips move, and a lot of you guys like to watch my lips move, and this just don't do justice for my lips. <sighs> shit! Let the bitch be free. Yeah, I don't have no special plans for this vlog. I definitely wanna go to the bar and get me a drink or two, probably two or three. Maybe three and, and two shots. Check out my feet work, period. Okay, gotta have them legs out. You know, I'm psycho bunny on the top. You don't know what that is? You don't shop in Atlanta, period. The Howard Boy. Don't stop me up. You don't wanna get, you don't wanna stop me up. You don't wanna Stop me up, you don't wanna, you don't wanna stop me up, you don't wanna I be on a mission, if you got the key then well I be on a mission Grant that for the three or whatever, I be on a mission Do it all the time, you know that I be on a mission The first two that I went to and no gas. What be scaring me is when I don't see nobody at the pump or when I see a truck at the pump, I'm like, yeah, this gas station ain't the gas station for me. I do not condone drinking and driving. So please, you guys, please do not drink and drive. Uh, matter of fact, I'm not even driving. I'm not, I'm not driving. No, no, I'm not driving. My soul is tied to the wheels, what's going on. So right now, I'm about to go to CVS and then I'm going to, cause I'm about to get stressed out because I feel like baby girl had a smart ass fucking mouth. Aren't all CVS is called CVS Pharmacy? I mean, am I right or am I wrong? Or am I wrong? I don't know. But yeah, I'm about to go to CVS and then I'm gonna go get me a drink or three and an appetizer. But then we're gonna go go shopping. Hopefully by that time my baby is off of work and that is when this vlog went in because I really wanna spend time with her. I really miss her, you guys. And I know that she misses me. Let me tell you something. I had to come see my baby. Because... Alright, I made it to CVS. And what does that say? CVS Pharmacy. I just really feel like she was trying to be a smart ass when she said this is... Not CVS. Duh, it's fucking Target. She was already looking at me crazy. Yeah, that's right. Have a wonderful day. You too. Hi, do you have this uh, tea tree oil? If we have any, it's on our eight. Okay. Uh, and it's alphabetical order with the vitamins. Okay. And I have another question. I was at a Target and they had a CVS pharmacy inside the Target. Where they had carry this as well, the lady made a comment and said that this isn't CVS, but obviously it was inside the okay. store. Oh, I don't know if Target can carry it or Okay. I know we do. Have, we do own their pharmacy. Right. It's, you know. But just like the pharmacy part, not necessarily what you have right. in aisle. Okay. Uh -huh. You said aisle seven. Eight. Eight. Thank uh -huh. you. She better be glad she saved her ass. I'm looking for the tea tree oil. Got some. Well, it's this one right here. here. And then I've got this one. Oh no, that's not for that. So little, I gotta remember where. Mm -hmm. No. Oh, thank you so much. I'm gonna get the big bottle. Thank you. And it's the last one. I wanted to tell you guys, out of all my tattoos, I only got two done in the shop. But when I was first getting my tattoos done, my tat man told me to use A and D ointment. What do you guys use? Baby told me to use this. And I'm not gonna lie. It definitely has like did its justice for my tattoo. She said the reason why this one is like kind of gray 
is because I was using the A&D on me. I used this on this tattoo here and it looks really good. So I just wanted to put that out there. But yes, we have what we came here for, the last one. So everything happens for a reason and this was meant to be. Oh, I need some masks. Today's gonna be an awesome day, awesome weekend. I hope that you're having an awesome day, awesome weekend with a whole lot of great vibes going on, big period. I asked people what they wanted to see on my channel and because my main channel I can do pretty much anything and everything. It's not limited to just reactions. It's not limited to just fitness, like my other two channels are. A lot of people like my vlogs, and I don't vlog enough, but I be having some pretty lit fucking days by myself. I gotta find me a nice restaurant or a bar to go to. I'm not from here. I'm in Alabama, by the way. I don't, I don't think I even told y'all where I was at. I'm gonna like run all of my errands here for most of them. I think when I do the grocery shopping part, I'm gonna go back to, I almost told you. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to where I'm supposed to be going. I'll see you in the car. So I almost forgot to get the mask, but I got the mask. And yeah, I'm gonna go have a drink. Hopefully it'll help me stop thinking about my panties being stuck to the crack of my ass. I still got a little wax in the crack of my ass. It happens, you guys. You know, she get everything, but she can't get everything. Like, she get all the hair, but she can't get all the wax off. I don't know. But yeah, I'm like, why is my panties stuck like that? I'm like, oh, I still got wax in my butt. <laughs> I think that is so funny that you still be having wax in your ass. But I need to find me a bar, I need to find me a restaurant or something that has nice, pretty appetizers and really good, tasty, delicious, get you lit drink with a very friendly, nice, conversational bartender. That's what I need. It is 11.20 here in Alabama, but where I'm originally at, the time is actually... 12 time goes back when I get there. I love you and I know that you love me and if you want more vlogs you guys Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you comment down below. All right. I'm actually gonna also be doing some Other new things that I haven't tried literally haven't tried it in my mouth I'm gonna try it for you put it in my mouth for you. So yeah, Make sure you are subscribed to my channel like this video comment down below make sure you share my content and I'm gonna see you at the bar <laughs> yeah, if you looking for me, I'm at the bar. I'm about to go to the bar right now. I literally just pulled in the parking lot of this cigar bar. Can you see the sign? A lot of places are not open and I found this. So hopefully I can sit inside and smoke a cigar and drink. If not, then I'm going to find somewhere else to go. So let's just see what's going on. And if they got a problem with me bringing my camera, I'm definitely going somewhere else. So let's just see. What's I'm about to get me a strawberry margarita. And I'm not really, I'm not a cigar smoker. So I'm here just for an experience. So he asked me like what kind of cigar am I interested in? And I told him like mild, sweet. Because I used to smoke black and mild. So the black and mild I used to smoke, I at first started smoking wine. Then it's taking me a headache, and then I start smoking the regular black and mouths, and those are just too harsh. So I told him something sweet and mild because I fell in love with jazz. Jazz is really mild, not really sweet, but it does have like you know like a a smell and a flavor to it. So I'm just here for an experience, you guys. Just want to like you know chill, vibe out. I'm definitely here for this strawberry margarita though. That's what I'm really here for. This is such a vibe. This, let me show you, first of all. This is their outside area. Oh my gosh, like I can't believe I just found this place. So you can't smoke the cigar inside, you have to smoke it outside, which is totally fine with me because I like to be outdoors, especially when it's nice weather and it's not, you know, too hot, too cold. It's like literally perfect weather. No bugs, ain't no bees, ain't no nets, ain't no roaches, ain't no, ain't no none of that. I got me a strawberry margarita. I got me a cigar. Now he said I can get this to be fatter and longer, but I'm gonna just smoke this one for right now. I don't know nothing about cigars, but he told me to not inhale it. So I asked him what cigar like a hookah, cause you guys know I love me a hookah. He said it is like a hookah, so pull it and then blow out. I just wanna vibe out real quick. Let me taste my drink, I didn't even try my drink. It's a strawberry margarita, I think I already said that. He could've gave me an extra shot though. Okay. Alright you guys, so I'm still 
I'm still here at the cigar shop. I actually ended up getting me a different type of cigar. So this one is fatter and longer. And I went a level up from harsh or from, I don't know. My harsh level went up a notch. Um, I'm on my second drink. So I got a peach flavor and I told him to use Patron. Still a margarita, but it gives me like mojito vibes. But after I finish my drink, I'm not gonna finish this cigar. I did finish my other cigar. I'm actually going to head over to a restaurant. He gave me two options. What did he say? I know one of them was like Amsterdam Cafe. He said that one of his homeboys is a chef over there and had really good food. Uh, a lot of like fish options. I think he said, I think he said, I'm not sure. Definitely, if you are on Instagram, make sure you are following me on all of my social media, you guys. Please continue to give this video a thumbs up, a like, and make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Make sure your bell is turned off all post notifications. Um, if you are watching this video, from beginning to the end, if you are at this point, let me get a green heart in the comments section, you guys. Even though I'm wearing like lime, let me get a green heart for the slums. Be clear, you know what I'm talking about. And uh, yeah, I'm just chilling, relaxing. This shit good as fuck. Okay, fat bottoms, daddy. See you at the restaurant. What's going on, you guys? So, I am at Amsterdam Cafe. I am still in Alabama. And I'm literally here just for an appetizer and another drink or two. I had two. I need about two more. And then the challenge is on, okay? Grocery shopping while intoxicated. It's on. Am I lit? I'm low key lit. I ain't like super lit. I'm turned up lit, like my litness is at a turn up, if that makes any sense. But, so I was looking at the menu. They have, you guys, a lobster egg roll or calamari, and I freaking love calamari. So I'm gonna see. I went live too. Everybody on my live when we do lobster egg rolls. I'm pretty sure everybody on my Instagram going when we do lobster egg rolls. But I don't know if I'm gonna do what the people say or do what I wanna do. So we're gonna see. You're gonna see. I'm pretty lit. Kids, do not drink and drive. I mean, don't drink at all, because you're not old enough. And adults, please don't drink and drive. It is not safe. It is against the law to drink and drive. Me, no, I'm not driving at all. But what I am gonna do, I'm about to go grocery shopping intoxicated, because I am intoxicated right now, so. Yeah, on our way to go shop. And I have to not, just go to one store, but I gotta go to two stores. I gotta go to one store for the condiments, and then I gotta go to the other store for the actual food and vegetables and fruits and snacks. I'll see you when I get there, big period. Nah, I ain't conceited. I'm, I'm a different breed. It. Catch you slipping, best belief. I don't need no reason. I'ma cut the ties, ho. Turn your wife to my ho. Just focus on you. Baby girl, <laughs> J vibes, you know the vibes, you know the fuck going on, and I'm out this bitch.